Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So I'm currently in my beauty room and I'm going to be getting ready for work. So I'm gonna show you guys what I do to get ready for work. I just took my dog out and it is so cold here. It's negative, negative degrees where I'm from and it's just like, oh, <laughs> it's so cold outside. Um, so I'm standing outside walking her and I'm like, I gotta go back inside. So she would not go to the bathroom, but she, it's fine, I'll take her out in a minute. But I wanted to film this video for you guys and kind of show you guys what I've been doing, some new products I got, um, and just life in general. All right, so the first thing I'm gonna do from tonight is I'm going to put some, do my skincare routine. I just washed my face and I actually got, um, these makeup sponges they're like compressed sponges and then when you put water they like expand they're so cool they're off amazon they're so cool um uh, but i use that to scrub my face and i got some and they're just they're just so cool um so with that being said um i i don't know aunt youtube tiktok everyone makes me buy stuff off like amazon stuff but I was gonna buy the the like the peeling lip liner and the peeling brow products. If you've tried those, let me know what you think. I just I don't know. I just like I don't want to buy something unless I'm like actually gonna use it. So I just I don't know how I feel about that. But and then this is just the vitamin C face cream by Kat Berkey. I'm just using it up. Um, you guys have seen me use this so many times. And then once I'm finished with that, I'll go to my Estee Lauder Daywear um, moisturizer. So. You guys have seen me use this in every single video. <laughs> it's just the moisturizer that I have right now. I've been using up. But yeah, this is a really good moisturizer just for every day. Let me know what you guys think. I just started the... So I'm going to do pretty much one video of cash stuffing weekly at least and then one video of makeup every week but let me know what you guys think about the whole cash stuffing thing um this is a new journey for me and i'm just learning how to cash stuff i watch videos on youtube like almost every night and it's just like a learning process for me um budgeting is a learning process like not being able to get my nails done or just like making choices in my life where i'm just like budgeting more um, or just in general, um, budgeting for things is really good. Like I have $30 every two weeks I put in my beauty fund and that's including nails. So it's like, I have to wait until I have enough money in there to get my nails done. So it's just one of those things like, um, you pick and choose, um, what you want to spend money on and right. it might be your nails. It might be your hair. But everyone picks and chooses what they spend money on. So. And then I'm just putting a little bit of my um, hyaluronic acid on. I went to my doctor tonight, my psychiatrist, and she told me that I'm deficient in like two different things. Vitamin D and folic acid. And I'm like, crap. And that could be causing a lot of my depression. So she recommended I take a supplement. So I just had to pay... $44 for two supplements tonight from the doctor's office. So I'm like, great. And like I said, I just started cash stuffing, so I did not have that budgeted. So it's like, that was just money like that I have that I have to find where that's going to come from now. Um, so it's just one of those things like when you budget and when you cash stuff, you will have money for things versus not, I guess. Yeah. So, and this is just a little bit of, like, oil recovery complex. I just put a little bit, like, right there. I don't have very many wrinkles, but... And like I said, I'm working overnight. I work overnight um, nannying right now. So it's just one of those things like I don't want to put a ton of makeup on because I'm just going to sit at her house after I put him to sleep. So it's like I 
I don't need a ton of makeup, but I have been trying. So I got this new Laura Mercier blush, and this is super pretty. This is in Grapefruit. I thought it was such a pretty color. Um, it shows up very, very, very um, dark on the skin. So I have to be very careful with it, but it's such a pretty color. I wanted to show you guys. And then I did go to Target today, and my husband bought me some stuff. So he bought me a mug, Valentine's Day mug, and then he bought me this blush. Uh, because I didn't have money in my savings for it because I've been budgeting so I was like I'm not buying it and so he just said I'll buy it for you so that was really sweet of him so I'm gonna put this blush on to try it um just to see how I think what I think about it I did return the other ones because the other ones were too light and too dark so I'm wondering if this one will be different because the other ones were just they were not working out for me so I did go ahead and return those to um target i don't know about you guys but i always buy my makeup from like target i buy some stuff from walmart like i'll buy like hair ties or like like scrunchies and stuff but recently i've been buying like all of my makeup from target i don't know why target just has a better um a better like vibe that better vibe better um better i just feel like they're more organized there and i don't know that i just can find products a lot better there so uh, i just i don't know i just like target target's mo that's sweet so i feel like a lot of people like target because target is just so clean inside and um but and this is the Grown Alchemist primer that I'm using. I'm just using this because I actually wanted to keep start using this try, to try it out. But I'm trying to condense products. So I'm trying to put products that like I want to use up in a certain section of my drawer. Because it's so easy to be like, oh, I want to use this product up. And then just not doing it. So it's like to actually sit, sit there and be like, I'm going to actually use this up is actually really smart um but it just takes time to use um use stuff up um with anything it's just trial and error trial and error um but i do like using products up so yeah This is just the Power Grip and Niacinamide. I don't know. I just, I like putting primers on because I feel like it keeps my makeup on longer. And then I put this gel in my hair. I don't know if you can tell. But I put, this is the edge control. I had my hair in a ponytail today. So I put this edge control, the Carol Daughter. This is so good. But it is so, like, greasy. Like, I don't know if you can tell this is hard. So I'm like, oh, it looks so. Hope it doesn't look bad on camera, but it just, oh, it's irritating me. I have to wash it out tomorrow when I get home. I would wash it out tonight, but I took a shower this morning already and I just don't really want to get back in there. So, but I'm going to have to wash, wash it out at some point. And then just blending it out with the beauty blender. I don't like wearing no makeup because I have acne. So I like having something in my face. Especially when I'm just babysitting. Like I just like to be presentable. The foundation is a little darker for me, but it works. Okay, and then I'm just going to apply my powder, which is just this um, pressed powder. I'm just going to use my Patrick One Size Powder Puff because 
this was $14, this powder puff, and I'm like really mad that I spent $14 on it, but it is what it is. It's a nice powder puff, but it's just, I didn't look at the price before I bought it, and it's just, it's just a lot of money for a powder puff. And then bronzer. I'm using the Hula bronzer. I was going to use my cream bronzer, but it's a little bit too dark. I don't want to go too dark. So, using my Hula bronzer. Okay, and then blush, we're going to go ahead and apply blush. Um, I think they said a little goes a long way, so I'm going to apply this with a sponge, but I want to make sure it's going to go on. So I'm applying with like a disposable sponge. You can get these like Walmart, Target, anywhere. Um, they're not as popular anymore just because everyone has beauty blenders now, but I like the makeup sponges. I like the basic ones. This is first impression too. So this is first impression. Oh, that's pretty. That's really pretty. Yeah, that's really pretty. I like that. I like how it stays pretty dark. Like a little goes a long way though. Trying to blend this out is like torture. Yeah, that's pretty. That's really pretty. Perfect. And then I just throw these away because they're just, they're just little powder puffs. And then today I'm just using, this is the Honest Beauty uh, Vibe Liner Pencil Liner. I've actually been liking using this. I don't know, I've just been liking using this. So I'll drag it on my waterline, my lower lash line. And then I'll just kind of bring it up. Like that. For eyes, I'm just going to do something simple, so I'm going to take out, this is the Tartlet Energy Palette, which I really like. This is really, really pretty sh pretty shadows in here. And I'm just going to take this fluffy brush, taking the shade Uplift, which is a light blush pink. I'm going to put that in my crease. And then I'm going to take the shade um, on a flat brush. I'm going to take the shade um, Motivate, which is a foil shadow, foil pink shadow. And just put this on my half of my lid. I'm 
I'm just taking the shade Peaceful, which is like a champagne-y color. I'm just putting this in my inner corner. Okay, that's that. Simple, easy, not too hard eye look. Especially if you just want something simple, natural. Okay, and then I'm just gonna go ahead and apply some mascara and then do my brows. I'm just applying my big mood mascara by e.l.f. This is a good mascara. Like, I got all those lashes. And then just kind of coating the lashes. Okay, and then, then I'm just going to go ahead in with my brow pencil. This is the um, brow, give me, um, sorry. This is the Brow Wiz by Anastasia Beverly Hills. I'm just gonna kind of go in with this and just fill in the front. And then just fill out the tail. And that's just a little bit of brow gel on my brows. And then if you want to apply like a highlighter or something like that, you can um, <clears throat> should apply this pink flash. This is the Hourglass Highlighter in Pink Flash. Just applying this to the high points in my face. Okay. And then just using that Beauty Blender to just blend, blend out that blush. A little bit more and just kind of pat that blush and then blend out that highlighter okay and then you can take your clips out these are clips i got from walmart clips to put my hair back And I have that, that gel in my hair, so looks a little pink down, but I'm kind of make it better. Okay, so this is the makeup look. Um, I think it's turned out really good. This is pretty much what I look like like every single day. Simple, uh, natural makeup. I don't go crazy, crazy on the makeup. Sometimes I'll do blue or green, um, but mainly I look pretty much like this. So, And then I'm going to go ahead and with a little lipstick. Um, any lipstick is good if you want. Um, I'm just going to use this MAC one in Plum, Plumful, I guess. Alrighty, and then you can always add like a headband or something to your look if you want something a little bit more um, vibrant or something. Um, you can always add like a little lip, lip oil. Um, I'm gonna, I am going to add a little bit of a lip oil so my lips are hydrated. This is just the Ulta Beauty one. And there you have it guys. This is my makeup look. And then if you guys haven't already, check out my cash stuffing video. I will... Um, I'm uploading it tonight, so if it's not uploaded by the time I post this video, then just let me know. But I will be uploading my cash stuffing video. It doesn't show you the actual like cash stuffing, it just shows you like what I'm using, my products I'm using, um, just pretty much everything that I'm using, and then what I'm how I'm doing it. Um, to kind of just introduce cash stuffing to you guys and show you guys how to do it and stuff like that. 
Um, but just let me know what you guys think. And as always, stay happy, beautifuls, and have a great rest of your week. Bye.